Hello friends and family from Universal's Islands of Adventure. Today we're going to head into islands. There are so many new updates. We have a ride that just actually recently reached its anniversary. We have another ride that also just recently reopened. And we have some awesome Jurassic World Dominion merchandise to check out. And we're just going to see what's new here at Islands of Adventure. But before we get started, if you would subscribe and click that bell notification so you're aware of future uploads and live streams, we would greatly appreciate it. It is such an absolutely beautiful day out today, guys. So incredible. Like, it is June right now, and look at the palm trees blowing. Like, it is just some amazing weather that we're having. Like, look at them going right there. It is, like, not humid at all. As we're making our way into Islands of Adventure, they do have all of the turnstiles opened up today, like in the middle and on the left and the right. So I'm assuming it's probably going to be some decent crowd levels today. I just absolutely love Port of Entry here at Islands of Adventure. Like look at these guests right here, just getting their picture taken, having a great time. But our adventure begins here in Islands of Adventure. Over here in Port of Entry, I actually noticed the new Minions popcorn bucket. These are $38 and the first refill is free, but get a load of this popcorn bucket. Like look at that, like all the different emblems on the side here. We have Villain Con, Universal Studios, Funland. Look at that, you actually have literally a Minion driving the car and like one on the uh, hood and another one holding on the back for dear life. This is probably one of my top three favorite popcorn buckets, like whether being Disney or Universal. Also, in case you missed our last update video from the studio side, they have a new treat here for the Wizarding World. They now have dark chocolate frogs. You can mix and match them with the milk chocolate, and these are three for $33. Come to think of it, actually, in the description box of this video, I'll actually leave a link to our update video that we did over in Universal Studio side, because again, they got the chocolate frog update and the new interactive wand, which is incredible. The Incredible Hulk roller coaster. Currently, a 45 minute wait today. Let's head on into Seuss Landing for our first official update of the day. That is correct. The Kara Seussel is officially back open for business right over here. Absolutely incredible, guys. They must have finished the roof on the uh, Kara Seussel, but it's so nice to see that back up and running for park guests to enjoy once again with the Seuss High in the Sky trolley ride buzzing on by. As we further our way here into Seuss Landing, there's actually not too much of a line right here for this character meet and greet. But right over here we have Thing 1, Thing 2, look at that, and the cat in the hat himself. This is so incredible. And actually, right over here is normally where you'll get to meet the Grinch. I cannot wait for Grinchmas this year. Oh, we even got King Julian and the gang over here getting down with their bad sales. Look at them. <laughs> oh my word. Madagascar is such great movies and King Julian is totally one of my favorite characters. Look at that, they're even bowing down King Julian. Oh. <laughs> Look at this, the sign actually changed over here. We now have the All Hallows Hula Boutique. Let's head on in though, see if they have any new HHN merchandise. Universal Studios always does like such a great job with the theming and like all the uh, like the tribute stores and this one specifically. But like, isn't this 
so nifty to see, like absolutely incredible. And look at the uh, surfboard right here. It looks like Jaws took a little bite out of it. But I do want to look over here. They have some of that Halloween Horror Night merchandise that we have seen in the past. Michael Myers, this is that black light reflective shirt. These here are $33. You could also get this Frankenstein's Monster t-shirt. I love this one actually. This one here is $30. Also for $33, you can get this Frankenstein's Monster Super Soft Micro Blanket, it says right here. Strange, Savage Killer Frankenstein. This is also like very surprising. There's no line over here for Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventure. I do want to check the posted wait time once we head over here into Hogsmeade. Oh, okay, here it is. The line starts here, it says. It's currently a 115 minute wait for Hagrid's. But the line for Butterbeer, as always, is ever so growing. Like the end of the line is actually way back here. Okay, what is seriously going on with Universal Studios and work walls? Right now I'm actually over here where the Tri-Wizard Spirit Rally normally is. And we have some work walls over here. Completely surrounding and encasing the area where they have the Tri-Wizard Spirit Rally. And also the Frog Choir. It's going to be interesting to see what it is they're doing with this area now. Welcome to Jurassic Park. And actually, we have both torches lit today. Like, how exciting is that? The wait time for Velocicoaster. Currently, only a 35 minute wait. While we're over here, I have to wish the Velocicoaster a happy one year anniversary. It has seriously been one year since the Velocicoaster has officially opened over here in Islands of Adventure. That is so hard to believe. Can you believe it's already been a year since Velocicoaster opened? Like seriously guys, where does the time go? I feel like especially living here in Florida, like frequenting theme parks and having like so much to do all the time, like the days and the weeks go by so, so fast. Let's head on into the dino store here, right next to the Jurassic Park Discovery Center, and check out some of that Jurassic World Dominion merchandise. They have some kids' t shirts right here for $23. Then they also have some new, new dinosaurs right here. This is part of the Uncaged series. I guess these ones here make noises and open their mouths. These ones here are $50. Then they also have right down here. Look at the size of this one. Oh, look, listen to him. His eyes light up too. His eyes light up. That is amazing. Look at that. And these ones are $50 as well. It's kind of weird how the big one's 50 and so is the little one. For $40, they have Uno Attack. And seriously, like how much fun does this look like? It's Uno Attack Jurassic World Dominion for $40. They even have a couple plushies over here. For $27, they have this Jurassic World Dominion t-shirt. And like, this is extremely soft. Like, I really love this one. Then over here is a Jurassic World Universal Studios t-shirt for $35. I love this coffee mug though. Look at that. Jurassic World. I love the whole design on the thing. Jurassic World on the other side. And these here are $17. But they do have another new cup. This one here is pretty incredible. Like this one I feel like is a lot of fun for the kiddos. This one is actually only $10, believe it or not. 10 bucks. For $70, they even have this new dinosaur mask for Jurassic World Dominion. This is one of those ones that you put behind your head and then you have like a little chin strap. Like, look at this. Oh, that is so fun. If the Jurassic World Dominion merchandise isn't your thing, they have a plethora of games over here where you could actually win some really cool Jurassic World merchandise. Do you can even get like a Mr. DNA? And they even have like a random plushie right here. And an ape. Over here at Pizza Predatoria, they have some new banners right here reflecting Jurassic World Dominion. That's actually like a really nice touch. It's really cool like to see that they're continuing the uh, Jurassic World Dominion theming. Like even at some of the uh, quick service restaurants. The Jurassic Park River Adventure currently is only a 45 minute wait. I 
I can't think of any better way to get misted on a hot day than over here at the Jurassic Park River Adventure. Over here at Dudley Do Right's Rip South Falls, you can actually purchase tokens. It's a dollar for two tokens, or it says the best deal is five dollars for 12 tokens, but you can use any of these water cannons completely lining this area and like some of the cannons like are right over here and as some of the flumes come by you can actually squirt the park guests. <laughs> However in my humble opinion as far as water rides go here at Universal Studios my favorite for many reasons has to be right over here Popeye and Bluto's bilge rat barges and it's actually currently only a five minute wait at the moment. to say is a proper soaking but if you're over here in this area I do strongly suggest you head right over here in this direction do me ship the olive because up there on the second floor you have some pretty awesome water cannons probably as we all know but they are completely free Hi. <laughs> hey. you. you're welcome and of course after you give everybody a proper soaking or if you are soaked yourself you can come over here to the people dryer and actually get dried off for the low, low price of $5. I just made my way over here to Marvel Superhero Island. I actually do want to head into the comic book shop and see what's new in here. For $82, they have this new lounge fly here from the Falcon. This is a Marvel lounge fly. It says right here, the Falcon Winter Soldier. Like that is really nifty. And actually, right behind it for $55, you can actually get the matching wallet as well. But how awesome is this Danielle Nicole bag right here? And this one here is $79. You have the Spider-Man symbol, has a cherry. Actually it looks like it's a, like a Spider-Man cupcake or a sundae, if you will. Here's the strap in the back. Like this is really, really nifty. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Very nice. And the cooler part is, I think I can get this right. There we go. The time stone comes out. Oh, get out. Not even joking. That's really cool. Oh, yeah. It's a popular toy, believe it or not. Everybody loves it. So, this is the most popular item for Doctor Strange based in the movie as well. Right. The cool thing is, the way how this opens, it's really a wind up toy. You just close that, push it again, just like that. I love it. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Thank you. No problem. My pleasure. Yep. That Doctor Strange wind up toy that that team member just showed us, seriously, I almost bought it. Like that is that good of a toy. Like and they came out, like that was incredible. I feel like the character meet and greets over here and like Marvel Superhero Island, they're just always like some of the coolest. Look at them, they're like staring her down right there. Like this is just awesome. Before we head out of Islands of Adventure, I do want to check out Port Provisions, Souvenirs and Gifts because oftentimes like they'll have some pretty good discounts like clearance items because like you never really find that over here at Universal Studios so much but it does look like they have those Chance and Jack jars these are from last year's Halloween Horror Nights 30 years 30 fears and these right here are actually three for six dollars a piece from the holiday season they have the greetings from Mistletoe Mistletoe Pines Village. This was actually from over there on Universal City Walk. These are originally $12, and then they were marked down to $7.99, and now they're only $6 a piece. But I do want to show this t-shirt as well, because I really like this one. Again, greetings from Mistletoe Pines. And this t-shirt right here was originally $25. Now it's only $16.99. Then a really vibrant Universal Studios tote bag. I feel like this one would be really good for the beach. This one was $38, now only $25.99. Then they have like a little matching wallet to go with it. And these ones here are $14.99, originally $24. I had such a great time checking out all of the updates over here in Islands of Adventure. Like it's so nice to see the Carousel Cell is back open, one year anniversary for the Velocicoaster, and all of that Jurassic World Dominion merchandise is really, really nice. But if you like today's video, give it a big thumbs up, and as always, make today awesome.